Welcome back, everybody. Moving on to another question. We're going to have to sketch a function that satisfies these four conditions. So f of 2 equals 4. Limit as x approaches 2 from the negative side equals 7. Limit as x approaches 2 from the positive side is equal to negative 5. And f of x is decreasing when x is greater than 2. So if we draw this out, notice that this uh, x value of 2 is mentioned everywhere. So let's just label that x value of 2 right there. So let's start off with this one, f of 2 equals 4. Well, that means that function is going to be defined right there. And then we're told the limit as x approaches 2 from the negative side of the function equals 7. So let's put a y value of 7 up there. Uh, and since the function is defined here, it can't be defined at that y value 7. So we would put a hole there. Let's maybe put like a horizontal line like that. And then the limit as x approaches 2 from the positive side is equal to negative 5. So negative 5 is going to be down here. And that's going to be a hole as well. And we're also told that f of x decreases when x is greater than 2. So if it's decreasing, if we read from left to right, means the y values are going down. So let's draw a downward sloping line. And this here satisfies all of these conditions. So f of 2 equals 4. Notice that's where the solid dot is. The limit as x approaches 2 from the negative side is equal to 7. We're approaching that y value of 7. Limit as x approaches 2 from the positive side is approaching this y value of negative 5. And f of x is also decreasing when x is greater than 2, meaning that when we read from left to right, function is going down, the y values are going down. Whether you want to make a curve for that, I just made a downward sloping line.